Hello everyone, welcome back again to Onhot channel. My name is Anas, I'm working for you. So if you have any questions, any video requests, make sure to drop them below in the comment or check out my Instagram right here below. I do reply to each comment. If you are wondering again, why is that? Because simply, I'm working for you. And in this video, I will show you how to change the menu font size for your Shopify header. So lately, I did post a video on how to change, I think, the background for the menu, drop down menu. Then I got a question from a subscriber. I think he's a subscriber, I'm not sure. But anyway, he did ask me how to change the font size on the whole header for his Shopify store. And I did provide them with the information he needs. However, I got the same idea. M many people will ask me the same question again and again. So instead of replying to each comment, I can just do a video. So whoever has the same question, he can easily find the video and watch it and fix the problem. That's why in this video, I will show you how to change the font size for the header for any Shopify store. And yes, this trick will work for any Shopify team. Whatever if you're using Downchain or Sense team, I did actually test it on multiple teams, including Sense and Refresh team and Downchain, which is the team I'm using right now. And yeah, the Shopify store that you see right now in front of me is actually uh, Downchain. And all the things that you see here, I did them in videos, including the video banner right here, include as well as the header right here, transparent header and the videos playing underneath it and the hover effect like this as well as removing the underline for the menu once you hover over them and a lot more actually. I did even show you how to remove the cart icon from here and the search icon from here. So whatever a small thing that you cannot do from the team customizer, you will find how to do it on my channel. And the things I do show are only on my channel and you will not find them anywhere else. And as well the code, you will not buy it for like five dollars or something like that. The code will always be available for free in the description box. All the thing I'm asking for is this thing right here. Just a like please. For the sake of this emoji right here as you can see. If you want to transform this emoji into a smiley one, just drop me a like. I would really appreciate that. And let's just quit talking and show you how to remove the size for the menu right here. This is what I'm talking about. If you want to make the menu font size right here much bigger or smaller actually. And the best thing about the trick I'm going to show you in this video is you will have actually the option to change for both mobile as well as desktop. So you will have two values. The first one is for desktop, which is the thing I'm using right now. And the second value is only for the mobile. So you can check actually you have different values and set the size that you want for the desktop as well as the size you want for the mobile. And I repeat, they will not have the same value. You can change each one to a different number, which will be the size obviously. And without any more talking, let's just jump to it. But before we start, as always, please, if this video helped you out, help me out pressing that like button. That's the only thing I'm asking for. And it will motivate me to make more videos for you guys. So I would really appreciate it. And let's quit talking and let's get to it. Obviously, the first thing you're going to do is access Shopify dashboard, right? Next thing you're going to do is click on online store from the left menu. Then click on the three dots right here on left of customize. And you will see this drop down menu and click on edit code. After that, it will take you to the code editor for your Shopify team. And the next thing you're going to do is access team.liquid. And you will see it obviously at the top of the options right here, either the first one or the second one, which is team.liquid. If you cannot find it here, then instead use the search bar in here, just type in team and it will show you team.liquid and simply click on it and you will see a bunch of files, bunch of code, sorry, in here. And no worries, you will not edit any code or anything like that. I will provide you with a very short code that you will paste in in team.liquid and that will do the magic of changing the menu font size for both the mobile and the desktop and set each one differently so you can see the perfect size that you want for your Shopify store. The next thing you're going to do now is scroll down to the bottom of the page and make sure you do find forward slash boring and make sure you do find this forward slash boring. If you cannot find it in here, just use the control F if you are on Windows uh, or I'm on Mac, click on command F and it will show me this prompt right here at the bottom of the page and simply type in forward slash body and it will highlight as you can see here. Make sure you do hit enter and it will highlight it on the code for you. You don't have to look for it. But for most cases, it will be at the bottom of the page. After you did find forward slash body, the next thing you're going to do is always scroll down the description box and you will see a link name it as code. And you will not have to pay for it or anything like that. Simply click on it and it will take you to this page right here where you're gonna see this very short code that will do the magic of changing the font size for the menu for both mobile as well as the desktop. The next thing you're going to do is obviously select this code right here, which is 11 lines to be exact, then right click and copy. After you did copy the code in here, get back to the code editor 
and paste it above forward slash body. I repeat, not below, but actually above forward slash body. And this is really important. Make sure you do paste it above it and before it. Otherwise, it will not work. So simply paste it in here. And after you do paste it in here, you will see two options in here for the font size. The first one is set to 18 and the second one below it is set to 12 right here, as you can see. So this is the first one is for the desktop, which is set to 18. So make sure to keep that in mind. So the first one in here is for the desktop. So in case you 18, I'm going to change it to, to 22, for example, just to make it more bigger so you can see the changes like this. Then the second one, as I said, is for the mobile. So this one is set for 12. I'm going to keep it as that. So make sure to play around with numbers and save the changes and get back to Shopify store and check how does it look like. If it's much bigger, then lower the numbers. If it's much smaller, then increase the numbers. That's really simple, right? So let's just click on save here. Then we'll get back to the Shopify store and reload the page and see if that will work or not. And it will actually. So let's just get back in here. And right now I will reload the page and the menu in here should be bigger, not smaller, bigger because I did increase the number. So let's just reload the page. And here we go. Check out how big it looks now. So this is much, much bigger as you can see. Let's just get back in here quickly and change it to like 12 and save it just so you, you can see the changes and reload the page and here it is right now it's much much smaller as you can see so as i said make sure to set the number then check on the store and play around the numbers to make the perfect size you want and here you go that's how you change the font size for the menu on your shopify store easily without any apps or anything like that and as i said if you have any questions any of your requests make sure to drop on below in a comment or check out my instagram right here below me I don't reply to each comment. If you are wondering again why is that? Because simply I'm working for you. Otherwise, I think my job is done for this video. So thanks for watching. Catch you on the next one.